Or penny shopping is a secret, so keep it to yourself. You buy things for one penny at Dollar General. Please remember when you're penny shopping at Dollar General not to ask the Dollar General employees for penny In items. In order to get the exact list, sign up for text notifications. Penny to 304-244-4457. I also post a list on my website, thepennylist.com, and my YouTube channel every single Monday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. We have at least 10 different items on clearance, a lot of them like 90% off. I bet some of them you're not even aware of, so I put a video to together for you of all of the clearance currently at Dollar General. Of course, could change on Tuesday. And if anything, pennies or clearances down further. I have to double check every single Monday if there's a penny list for Tuesday. Fall stationery. So if you don't know, fall stationery is going to be like the football plates and napkins and all of that kind of stuff. To 70% off. What like is very interesting about the fall stationery is some of my stores have a lot of it and some stores have none of it whatsoever. Very beneficial thing of making these types of videos that are telling you what is expected depending is you can go to your stores and kind of scope out each store has and kind of keep track of it. Things like air fryers, crock pots, coffee tables, end tables are currently 90% off at Dollar General. But some of them have a brown dot on them and they're going to be excluded. And then we also have items that are going to be unmarked brown dot. I'm going to show you what all of those items are. That way when these items go to 70% and penny out, you're going to know exactly what to grab and be able to do it really quickly and get a lot of items hopefully. Before I show you those items, I want to make sure you're all signed up for text alerts. You can text penny to 304-244-4457 and sign up. That way if these items surprise Penny or anything, I'll be able to send you a text notification. Now, obviously if you guys don't know, brown dot items have a little brown dot somewhere near the tag, usually on the product. Sometimes that dot can look tan, but it is definitely brown. This is why I'm showing you a large variety of items so you can get familiar with what is and what isn't brown dot. Now I'm gonna show you the screenshots of excluded brown brown dot and brown dot that is unmarked clearance and is going to penny out that you don't know is brown dot. So first we're going to do the excluded ones. So these screenshots that I'm showing you have a brown dot on them, but they're not going to clearance out with brown dot and they're not going to penny when brown dot pennies. I was sure on all of these screenshots to put excluded somewhere on the screenshot. So if you do screenshot these or get them from my website, thepennylist.com, you know that they're going to be excluded, meaning they're not going to clearance down and they're not going to penny out with brown dot. They will penny later at Dollar General. So we're going to kind of forget about these. But if you find these, take them up to the register and they don't ring up the clearance price or a penny, there's nothing really that they have to do about these items. So just be aware of that. I found most of these items at NCI stores, although some of them might be at regular Dollar General stores too. And here's the part we've all been waiting for, unmarked brown dot. This is such a big deal. I cannot stress to you how important these items are because when brown dot pennies the Dollar General employees likely are not going to know that these items are included. Which also means other clearance and penny shoppers are not going to know that these items are included. So that betters your chance of finding these items. First, we have a Toastmaster crock pot. It does not have a brown dot on it. It is a smaller crock pot. The original price of this item was $10. We have a few licensed character blankets. So we have this little Batman blanket that has like a hood on it. The UPC is on the screen. You can match that up in store or put that in your Dollar General app to get the price in your area. Uh, we have another licensed character blanket. This one is going to be a Paul Patrol blanket. The original price of these were $20. This one also has a hood. We have one more of the more expensive uh, licensed blankets. This one is an LOL brand. The UPC is on the screen. If these pictures are blurry, I also posted them on my website thepennylist.com. We have this family collage. This is at Dollar General, obviously. It does not have a brown dot on it, but it the price is going down with brown dot. I separated this Minion licensed for fleece throw from the other ones because the original price was much lower. It was only $7 original price. UPC is on the screen. So we have this Mickey Mouse uh, coffee cup warmer. Original price was $10. Um, there may also be some more Mickey Mouse products that I do not have in this video. If you guys have pictures of them and you know they follow Brown Dot, text them to me, please. We also have a Mickey Crock Pot. This is also a smaller 
crock pot. Here comes the air fryer and other items. Now this was originally, I believe $35, the griddle, the air fryer, and then there's another bigger crock pot. These are the Toastmaster brand and they just have a yellow tag in the upper right hand corner. These wire coffee tables and end tables are marked brown dot. This week at Dollar General, we had the Easter candy go down to 50% off. Your store might have a lot of Easter candy or they may have just a little bit and then the Easter seasonal items went to 70% off. Sandals are usually yellow dot or green square which is really weird to me because those are usually summer items not winter items. Blue dot is winter item. I want to ask you guys about these flip-flops that I found because I found several different designs as you can see, they are blue dot FW20. These rang up clearance. I think they were like $1.37. I had not seen these at my store, and they're Charles Albert brand, which is usually NCI, but these were at a regular Dollar General store. Did they accidentally put these out and tag them as blue dot? Had you guys previously seen sandals like this? that were blue dot let me know in the comments i really need to know yesterday april 20th of course which is tuesday i did go to dollar general i found some red square shoes and they were all ringing up for the price of one dollar no matter what the original price was each year at dollar general red square shoes surprise penny and these are more typical winter shoes they're like house shoes and rain boots and those types of things although today i will say I did find some red square shoes that were almost like sandals but they were furry inside even more of a winter type sandal so a dollar is a great price but of course these will penny later I just wanted to let you guys know in case you were interested in purchasing any of the red square shoes and definitely keep an eye on these and find out where they are in your store I promise you they're gonna penny soon I was just intrigued by the blue dot mostly because it looked like they had just been putting out there were a lot of them but don't tell anybody about the red square shoes they will surprise penny and we want some to be left when they penny out. i send out text notifications to get penny items and deals especially at dollar general text me 304-244-4457 next we have nci items so these are home store items if you don't know what nci or home store is i'll link a video in the description but these are clothing items a lot of them are fourth of july items there are also some clothing items. I'll show you screenshots and UPCs at the end. These are also hev heavily percentage off. Last time I checked, they were 70% off. You can look for them at NCI stores. They should penny very, very soon. You guys know a few weeks ago, we also had those zone NCI items that surprise pennied. There is more on that list that is not a penny. I have the current prices on the screen right now, um, but those those are at NCI stores. If you get visuals, email them to me, please. That is everything I currently have on my list at Dollar General that is a percentage off. If I missed anything, let me know in the comments so we can add it to the list. I think the only thing I know that I didn't say is gray dot clothing, but the, that goes along with the blue dot clothing.